today with another wig review. So in today's wig review, I'll be showing you guys the unit from ChinaLaceWigs.com. So I've worked with them before, and you guys know their company is very, very popular. So the unit I'm going to show you guys today is this Kinky Straight unit. Now this unit is 22 inches long, and it's about 150% density. It is a lace front style unit, and it is a natural color, and it is kinky hair. Now, it does come straight, obviously, and what I'm going to do with this one is lightly straighten it just so I can get it to get this machine or this packaging dent out. Now, it does come with your standard cap, and it has three combs at the top, two on the sides and one at the base, as well as a comb in the back with an adjustable strap. Now, I'm not going to add in my, my elastic band to this one just because the wig is a, perf is a good size and it fits well. If you do have a wig that doesn't fit so well, just add an elastic band on it, but I won't. Now it does come with baby hairs in the front and the baby hairs are particularly long for my taste so I'm going to go in and blade them out a little bit just so I can blend them and make them look more natural. Now if you're interested in seeing what this unit looks like today guys, I would like you to stay tuned and keep on watching. love this unit now this is a unit that I will keep like this is so pretty and I'm so happy I got it in 22 inches I kind of felt like if I got it in 18 20 it just kind of would have been a little bit short the 22 inches is almost a 24 inch and it looks so cute guys like I didn't do baby hair crazy stuff this time just because the hair texture is kinky so you don't want to kind of do all that kind of soft baby hair look so I just did a little bit of it right here and then I just tucked everything back I did have to go in and add a hairpin just because I didn't glue this unit down this time around so therefore it was lifting a little bit on the side but once everything is adjusted guys this unit is like look at this guys oh my god and as you guys saw I did throw my I did flat iron it just a little little bit just so I can get a little bit um, of the bumps and, and dips out look at how nice this hair looks guys look at the texture of the hair oh. And like I'm not really like a kinky hair type of wear, but this right here is so so nice. Like I'm so happy that I got this wig. I did receive a little bit shedding. I noticed when I was kind of straining the hair out during the straining process. I kind of like pulled a few, a few strands out. But now that I'm just sitting here with you guys, I'm only getting like one strand and stuff. I'm not getting like the handful I was getting before. I'm not sure if it was because I cut the lace and I probably cut a little too close to the line. But um, since then, it has stopped. And God, the guys, the wig fits. Perfect. 
at that. This is so pretty. Like, if you're someone who likes that kind of natural, um, textured look like the african-american look this unit is definitely for you guys i think that this is so nice it is inexpensive guys if you guys want to get like the 360 you can go get the 360 i got the lace front now the lace front you only get about two inches of parting space but what i like to do with powder is i kind of like to extend the part a little bit into the uh cap so i kind of extend it to like about three inches so that's another reason why i use powder instead of concealer wet concealer to do my um parting and to kind of make my parts realistic just because you can make you can disguise a lot with the powder versus using the cream concealer so that's just a side note to let you guys know so if you want some more parting space try the 360 or try the full lace i think the lace front is perfect it's inexpensive it is a nice 150 percent density unit that is oh my god let me show you guys how long how long this unit is so it reaches just about to the point of my belly button Oh my god, guys, I am so, so pleased with this hair, guys. I absolutely love it. And this is one of those units I, will, I won't sell and I would keep this unit. And I know you guys ask me all the time about wig sales and stuff like that. I do have a wig sale coming. I'm just trying to gather my things up. So many things are, like, I have so many projects that I'm doing, so... It's getting crazy. So, um, thank you guys for stopping by today. Do not forget to thumbs up this video. Leave your comments down below. Hit that subscribe button and that share button. And I will catch you guys on another Wig Wednesday. Bye, guys.